this video I'm gonna show you what the games I, I have here on my Surface Pro device on uh, macOS or if you have any macOS system, any computer, any, any macOS computer, even M1 computer. So this is will work for you. I um, have to say it's kind of cool because because uh, um, you when you love to play games like you definitely um, you definitely will have a different kind of approaches to do installation. But this kind of thing is uh, for those who play like old games like Nintendo games like Mario whatever game you like. To play so this is like one thing I want to show you maybe you like it or not I prefer to play some games here I'm not a gamer but it, I have this kind of app installed and it's easy because it has like all my games in one place I don't need to like search um, like whole web to find something but um, yeah easy process install um well I start from the side which is open uh, emu whatever you name it um and go ahead and download for windows uh, or i mean like for macros right now uh and you will have like uh this um, app which is open uh, mue file so you need to open it and you need to basically have roms which is which is just files to run your games right and in my case um, yeah, I have few, a few of them, but we will talk a bit later about them. And it's just a simple thing. It's just drag and drop here. It's any game you like to play, so it's it's that easy. Like if you want to play Super Mario, just uh, start a game and you will play. And you, if you have like basically control or um your joystick whatever device to play uh, you're definitely able to play the game um yeah um if you need to if you need to just change controls this is how you do it it's basically the simple process controls gameplay uh library but most of it most of the time you will like change controls here because you have your own preference to just move um or run or jump whatever and yeah sometimes find the uh, you know like problems to change if i need to set up some something it's not works like you have here but uh, it sometimes happens but uh, if you have if you have this problem you just need to go to your system privacy system settings the system preference privacy go ahead and find for my case, it works when I uh, give the full access to this app, like full disk access, and uh, I switch on and off uh, here. I mean, like the message will prompt and say, "Okay, we need the, your privacy, whatever. Then we need to use your input controller." And so I've like toggle. Um, toggle in uh, on off and just like uh, do it again like and it works it, for, for some reason it does not work but maybe it helps like uh, yeah if you want to play the game but it has like the, some cool like shaders you can modify shaders make a scale whatever you want to scale it and yeah it's is that simple if you want to restart save the current stage like I'm playing like if I don't want to just like save a uh, game here in this kind of a stage and you can return back like pause uh, continue uh, play the game full screen yeah easy controls here like easy to just uh, make uh, whatever jump uh, run um, yeah you see I'm a definitely a great gamer but um, well I have like some even GameCubes, which is like, uh, which is a bit uh, different type of games. Like they have like three D graphics, and it's kind of cool because I'm a three D developer, uh, designer, whatever style designer. I mean, like I love to play 
uh, games, uh, these kind of uh, type of games. Um, yeah, and I have a Super Nintendo DS. Oops, sorry. Um, um, yeah, and just uh, just to show you some some games I, I kind of like, and and I play and have fun. Maybe you will have fun because I'm not like uh, know every single game here because. Uh, yeah, definitely. They they have some cool features. I'm not played for you know for quite a long time games, but I realized there's still so many cool games that you you want to play. Sometimes uh, the games uh, will not run correctly, but uh, I don't really don't really have these kind of problems. So um, yeah, um, you can see I've. Uh, on this game, I adjust controls like uh, like I change some uh, you know some controllers to make a game run uh, as as I want because I in this case I don't have like a controller. Uh, yeah, you can see it's it's kind of cool game. You can just do whatever I want like play cool game. Like you can see you can drop things like. Yeah, it's kind of cool, and and it it runs like really well on this machine. So yeah, it's pretty much it. I, like I just quit the game, and you have like homebrew here. You can basically get some games right right over here. So you, you like basically don't need to go in anything to search the games. But uh, in my case, I have like a website, which is like second uh, tab here, um, which is uh, romgames, uh, romgames.net. Um, and you can find, you, you know, a preferable game, this rating, and save games, like save games. It's just a basically a zip file. Um, and, and you just uh, drag and drop uh, the game. You, you're going to play because uh, I have like this uh, Mario 64 DS, I will not continue download because I have it in my library, which is kind of cool because it's just like a bunch of uh, games like in my library. And you see, I can re just basically resume the game if I not like if I stop the playing the game, and it's DS game. Um, well, I have like. I have like touch screen, but I use just uh, my my track trackpad to play the game. Like basically, it's a, you know like it's uh, it's that simple. You can just as you see, I can try run, jump. Um, well, uh, I have like some some cool stuff to do, but I'm not sure what I need to do. Like I just run here, and you see, and I'm jumping. I'm sure you played this game before and know what's the next step. Sure, I should collect items here on a level, on this level, and find them. I'm not sure where they are. And yeah, and, and the, uh, you can see it's same kind of a characters. I mean, like a models, uh, pretty much the same as the previous game. Maybe like they just have the same models. They just they just use them on different levels. Okay, I'm seeing I have different character. Just run, and yeah, it's work fine. I can just uh, make a full screen, and yeah, it's uh, pixelated, but I can allow the style. Yeah, and I just yeah, I just quit the game, and I can continue later if I want. And you can see that this is a bunch of supported platforms like. Um, Nintendo, whatever, it's just like, uh, just different kind of games, even uh, uh, Sega Mega Drive. Okay, um, yeah, it's pretty much it, what I want to tell you, um, just, just drag and drop you to your library. Sometimes it uh, prompts you to have like, don't have like different files, I just Google them and you can add them in the root of uh, folder. I, I mean, like I can show you how to do it. 
uh, as example, uh, you can right click on um, example this game not run for some reason. You can uh, find a folder and then like go to open UM and find the um, basically um, ROM, game library ROMs. And in my case, I put in like in subfolder, I'm gonna show you in which ones. So in, yeah, uh, as example, Sega Saturn, which is a folder, and I have like a uh, few games here. It's just few games, right? And Daytona, you're saying Mega Man. And I put here these two files, BIN files, BIN files, right? Uh, Sega MPR, they required to, to run the game uh, for for this platform specifically, I'm not sure about different kind of, but for those who play like Nintendo DS, you don't need all of these files. This is just NDS, or, you know, file. You just drag and drop it here. I mean, like in the in the pre preview folder, and it works. Or if you don't need this game, just remove it from here, and you basically de deinstall the game, deinstall the game, and. Yeah, if you go to old games, you will see, or you just delete games from here. Okay, that's pretty much it about the video and games I play. I love to play. I hope you like this video. I hope I hope this video helps you to install and maybe some uh, find some ROMs um, here. And I think you kind of like it because uh, it has like different, uh, well, different variations different kind of games so you definitely find something that you like or maybe find something some, somewhere else but it's definitely uh, cool uh, cool things to just play if you want them if you want to play them okay bye bye stay tuned thank you